Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. My name is Angelica Fitzgerald if you are new and if you are not new, welcome back. So today I'm gonna to be working with a brand called Michelle Dermaceuticals. I have four products here in front of me that I'm gonna use in the recommended order by the brand. And um, yeah, get some first impressions, first thoughts, and see how well this brand works. Before we go any further, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button down below. Now, let's get started. Okay, so it's really early in the morning. Um, I just woke up, if you can't tell. So I'm really hoping these products work. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about which products I'm using, how much they cost, and what the ingredients are inside them. Also, a little bit about how my skin reacts and some history on the brand. So as always, I will attach all the links below, um, the website, the products, um, and maybe if I find some cool other articles written about the brand, whether it's a good or bad one, I will attach it below. So we're gonna get started on the first product I'm using today, which is the Ultra Hyaluronic Eye Gel. So um, they are still in like the full boxes, haven't even taken them out yet. So this definitely is a first impression video. I'm gonna take it out. So this is what the little, little bottle looks like. Um, I gotta say this is the most basic little packaging thing ever. Like this is literally just a sticker slapped on. So um, let's hope the product's a little better than the packaging. So this is the eye cream. Oh God, it's all closed off. Ooh, it has a really nice smell to it. it smells like a cucumber. This is what it looks like. Can't tell, it's like very jelly and gooey. So a little bit about this product, the three main claims, it reduces puffiness, it illuminates, and it strengthens your skin. It's supposed to decrease the appearance of fine lines and dark circles, all of which sounds good. Let's see if it actually does that, see how it feels on my face. Um, I wanted to put this on first because the eye skin is a little bit different than the rest of your skin. It's a lot more tender and it absorbs creams and products a little differently. So I wanna go ahead and let this sit on my face as long as possible before I mix it in with the moisturizers and the other things that I have here. So I'm gonna go ahead and clip my hair back first with these monster clips. I know they look kinda silly, but they work. All right, so my face is freshly washed. I just put some soap and some water to cleanse it first. And I did put some water on just to have it be a little bit hydrated. I never do any kind of facial regime or use any skincare product without putting a little bit of water on my face, so my face does have some water on it. So let's just go ahead and start applying this. Wow, this is really jelly, really jelly. Now I am using a little bit more than I normally would because I really wanna see the effect of this. I always make sure to get the little creases that could potentially form under my eyes and especially the side, like where crow's feet would eventually come. All right, so this feels great on my skin. It's got like a cooling sensation. Um, it's very light, which I like, because since it is early in the morning for me, I'm gonna be putting my makeup on after this. Now, normally like you would do a full skin thing at the end of the day, but it's 6.30 a.m. I have stuff to do, so I'm doing this first and then I have to put my makeup on. So um, this does feel light enough to put some makeup on. I will see at the very end if I need to take all of this off before I put my face on, but I don't actually feel like there would be a need to do that because um, with the amount of time I'm gonna let this sit on my face, it should sink in nicely and my skin should absorb it. Okay, so a few little facts about the eye gel. I did just pull up the website on my phone, so I had all my bullet point facts. Uh, but it is $29 and the size is 0.45 fluid ounces. So you can travel with this, yay. A short little description about what's inside this. So it's a blend of Persian silk tree extract, caffeine, hyaluronic acid, and magnolia flower oil that helps nourish and hydrate and decreases the appearance of puffiness, dark circles, and fine lines. It's made without GMO, gluten, parabens, petroleum, silicone, sulfane, artificial fragrances and artificial colors. It's vegan and it's cruelty free. So um, I am gonna leave that last part out when I review the rest of these products because they're all cruelty free, vegan, free of parabens, petroleum, that whole shebang. 
Um, so that is one really good thing about these products. They're made really nicely and they do have some really nice ingredients inside. So that's a little bit about the eye gel. So next we're going to talk about the CBD lip balm. Here's the little box. It's actually a lot smaller. I'm going to take it out. And it comes in a little clear glass vial back. You can see it. Again, not the cutest packaging, but it's not always about the packaging. It's about what's inside. So let's just get some on our finger. Ooh, I like the way this feels. Now I'm typically never have really used CBD products. I'm not like the biggest fan. So this is actually my very first one. I definitely love the way this feels if you have enough on. I'm just gonna like keep lathering it everywhere. <laughs> this feels great on my lips. Love this. So a few details on what is inside this hydrating lip balm. It has um, CBD isolate. It has coconut, watermelon, and meadow foam oils for a soft, dewy look that's never sticky. This four-in-one lip treatment nourishes, soothes, deeply hydrates and primes lips to maximize the wear time of your lip color or you can wear it alone for a sheer glossy finish so i really like that that it's supposed to make whatever you put on top uh last longer and then again it's made without all the stuff that i listed before on their website there's a full disclosure of the ingredients according to the pcp standard since it does have cbd inside of it so um if you click their website and type in CBD lip balm, um, it'll provide all of those facts for you so you can make sure that exactly what you're getting in this product is up to standard. So we're gonna move on. And the fourth product I'm going to try today is the Hydrating Serum. So it comes in a bigger case. Literally, Basic Betty hit up the company that branded the exterior of this product because um, it's just very basic. But here's the vial. It is one fluid ounce, so we're going to go ahead and is the pump going to work? Can't get the pump to work. Oh, there we go. All right, so you just have to twist it to get the pump to work. This is, I've never had a serum that comes in a pump form, so, oh God, this is liquidy serum, very liquidy serum. Smells like uh, lavender, so it does have a scent to it. Oh, which the CBD balm did not have any scent to it. This feels great on my skin. Okay, so the serum kind of stings a little bit. Um, I have some open wounds when I cleaned it up earlier. I kind of opened up any little blemishes I have, which y'all can see I have like a little on my forehead and just right here and the serum is burning a little bit. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I know it's skin treatments, like the burning sensation means it's cleaning, but this is a serum. So I'm not sure that it is supposed to do this. So that's a note on this. Uh, I'm not sure why it's burning. It felt great at first. It has like that nice little stick to it. It smells like lavender. So my face smells awesome. It does have that hyaluronic acid in it. so. If I were to guess, that would be what is making my face sting a little bit. The three main things this is supposed to do for your skin is hydrate, smooth, and replenish. Like every other serum out there. It definitely feels interesting on my skin. Normally serums are a little more soothing, but um, this one's a little different. So this is one fluid ounce. It is $47 on their website. They do have this thing where if you auto ship like every few months and you have like a consistent uh, a consistent order of skincare coming in, it's like 20% off. So they do have that little discount in there, but you have to order it consistently. So that's totally up to you. Just wanted to let y'all know they have that. Um, a few things about the ingredients inside the product. So it is a nourishing active blend of hyaluronic acid, sodium PCA, and organic rose hip oil to boost moisture levels and condition and soothe the skin. It has fortifying amino acids, it provides a powerful anti-pollution, and it has antioxidant benefits inside of it. One other little thing I wanted to add is that while I'm on their website, I just noticed this as well. It says any order over $29 gets free shipping. So unless you go on there and only order like one 
tiny, tiny thing. You will spend over $29, so the shipping will be free. All right, so the last product I'm gonna be trying out today is their um, face cream. It's a big boy, it comes in a huge box. Um, this is called their Deep Repair Cream, so I think it's supposed to be extra nourishing. Um, oh, they got a little creative with the packaging here. This is actually an acute, like, little clear vial. Um, very pretty. Just gonna get a big glob of this and put this everywhere. Wow, this feels amazing on my skin. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, this is my favorite product of this entire line. This feels incredible. It smells like a flower. I think flowers are like the scents with this brand because everything else smells like a flower too. Um, literally, it smells like a rose. Wow, my face feels so good right now. I mean, so good. This is actually shocking because I, I wasn't like crazy, as y'all could tell, about the other products. They were just, they weren't bad, but they were just normal. Um, and when it comes to face stuff, we don't need normal, we need amazing. So this is amazing. Oh my God. My face feels amazing. Someday there'll be like a 40 YouTube where like you can touch my face and stuff. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna talk a little bit about the details of this product. Let me just pull it up. Okay, so this uh, deep repair cream is $32, which is actually a really good price for this. The other creams that I use on a daily basis are like double that. So this is a great price for this much of a cream. Um, this is 1.2 fluid ounces. And um, a little bit about the product. It's a luxurious moisturizer enriched with organic rosehip oil. So that's why it smells like rose. And uh, black currant oil to provide ultimate nourishment and hydration, helping prevent the visible lines of aging. A powerful blend of antioxidants, including kombucha tea uh, and vitamin B, and it helps revive and rejuvenate the skin's appearance. So I absolutely love this. The main three things this is supposed to do is nourish, hydrate, and restore, all of which I feel like it's doing. This, I feel like, has brought the life back into me. It smells so good. My face feels amazing. It's like bouncy, literally bouncy. Um, and you can use this up to twice a day, in the morning and at night. Those are the four products I wanted to try with y'all today. The Deep Repair Cream, obviously love, totally my favorite. The Hydrating Serum, I liked it. I'm just a little concerned on the burning sensation because I've never had a serum do that before. Um, but like I said, since it has that hyaluronic acid, I do believe that's why it is. It is more of a repairing serum um, that might actually blend well into like an acne treatment if you have that. Um, and then the eye gel felt really great as well. Um, however, it wasn't my favorite eye gel that I've used, so we can kind of throw that one away. And then the lip balm surprisingly was amazing. I definitely love it. Um, it does mimic a lot of the other lip balms out there. So I love this. I think everybody should have a lip balm like this in their arsenal of beauty products and health and skincare products. But I think you can find the same thing like in a million other brands. So if you don't have one already, definitely check out My Shell Dermaceuticals. Um, but if you do, just stick with the one you got. So out of all of these, my favorite was the Deep Repair Cream. I will be using this over and over and over again because my face, I kid you not, is just out of this world. I am in love with how it feels. So that is all for today. All of the products are linked below as well as their details, so definitely make sure to check those out. Other than that, I hope you guys have a fabulous day and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.